Hello, lovely people, and welcome to another episode. Today, I want to talk about money and abundance. Yesterday, I participated in a workshop about the money mindset. It was about how we deal with money. What it means to us and what relationship we have with it. Throughout the course, it was made clear that money is abundant, and I agree with that. It's just very unequally distributed, but that doesn't mean that we don't have opportunities, especially in Europe. To turn the tide for ourselves. At the moment, more and more women are forming and finally starting not only to talk about money, but also to understand money, to invest it. When I imagine how many great projects could be supported or implemented for the benefit of all, it motivates me to give everything and use all the resources at my disposal in the best possible way. At the same time, a great many people, regardless of money, are already living in abundance. The earth was originally a place where everything was available for everyone. Everything was in harmony. Then, man caused disorder and imbalance. When I'm here in my little world in the garden, I can see the abundance. And yes, I too intervene here. I plant vegetables and bring in an unnatural order. And yet, I leave space so nature can establish its full abundance as well in this garden, and it's really nice. In my imagination, almost everyone will have access to a garden. For them, a certain peace would probably return. Security, mindfulness, and all this without money, because plants reproduce themselves if you let them. If I leave the blossom, then seeds will grow from it. If I take only what I really need, then I already have enough, and even much more, because I have invested in my. Our future, and it is the same with money. We do not need much. One part we keep, one we consume, another part we invest, create something new with it. That way, we will be rich in the future as well.